Alright guys, we got a hundred dollars in nickels. So let's go ahead and open it up. Second. There we go. And not seeing any enders. So let's hop right into it. Alright guys, we're this far in. And I just pulled out this. I don't know if I don't know. I think this one was melted or something. Cause look how all the words are warped. And that's warped. You can definitely see that that's warped. So, I think it was melted, maybe? Or pushed against something? If you guys think that's an error, let me know below. But, yeah. Pretty crazy. Let's keep going. Alright guys, for the last two rolls, I'm gonna do this one first. Apologize about any background noise. So we're gonna go through it and see if we can find any old Jeffersons. Here's a 1970S. Pretty cool. I'll put that aside. And onto the very last roll. Maybe there's an old Jefferson in this one. No, it doesn't really look like it. Alright, that's it. So, let's get to what we found. Alright guys, here's what we found. We're going to start up here. We have a die crack 1964D nickel. We have this melted 1981. Uh, and we have this one that's been through the washing machine. We have one 2009 Denver, seven 1970S's, two 1968S's, and for the old Jeffersons, we have a 1959 Denver, 1956 Denver, two 1955 Denvers, 54S, 53, 253 Denvers, 52 Denver, 51 Plain, 40, uh, 149 Denver, three 1947 Plains, two 1946 Plains, a 1941 Plain, and four 1940 Plains. And down here, I think this might be a Black Beauty 1958 Plain Nickel. So, if you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.